Hi, I'm Roy Watring from Hoosier Crane, and today we're just going to show you how to change out a safety latch on just about any type of lower hook. Uh, this one just happens to be on uh, one of our cranes. You know, you first you identify that you have a bad safety latch. Then you, you need to remove the old latch. the old spring then you have to have the new proper latch for this particular model we're going to install the spring first we're going to set the latch over the spring you just need to take the two prongs this latch will fit right over it and then these two uh, prongs on the front of the latch will go inside the latch to help hold the uh, tension up on the spring. Then you'll take your bolt and you'll slide it through the hole into the second part of the spring that gives you the ability to take the latch down and put it on the other side. You're just going to push the bolt through and you're going to install your nut. You're going to tighten down this nut so that it is compressed into the nylock, but you don't want to tighten it so tight that you make the uh, safety latch not still be able to spring back. And that's, that's it. That's all you have to do to change out a safety latch. When identifying what latch you need, there's a couple different ways. You can, you can measure from the hole to where the latch is going to set and that tells you how long your front prong is going to be. Uh, and once you've identified your latch, and it could be a, a many different types of latches because there are many different types of hooks, but once you've identified the latch, then you, you can order it and bring it in. A lot of the numbers on a Crosby hook doesn't give us enough information to be able to order a latch, so that dimension will be very critical when trying to get a different style latch for your hook. 